Welcome to the 2015 Inside the Huddle edition for Lafayette College. We open up with William & Mary right here at Fisher Stadium on Saturday night at 6 o'clock. It's going to be a great game, and one thing I want to talk about is red zone. Lafayette's got to be good in the red zone this week. Anytime you step up against a CAA opponent, you want to make sure that you score and take every opportunity you can. I count the red zone, most people 25-yard line. I count it right around the 20-yard line, and Lafayette was very good last year in game 150 against Lehigh. Spread offense for Lafayette, Drew Reed in the shotgun, a lot of big, tall, wide receivers. When you got receivers out here that are six foot four like Morozik, six foot three out here, you got guys that can go up and get the football. One thing I'll point out you want to look for on Saturday, both corners for William and Mary are under six foot. So you know Mickey Fine's going to take an opportunity to go after them. Well, how do you do that? You run off the shotgun here, you can do your little inside quick handoff fake inside, pull a linebacker up, maybe hit a slant inside, look for that. A lot of good slot receivers, Lafayette, you're going to see some young kids in that position this year. On the outside, a little stutter fade to the outside, maybe a little shake trying to get inside, hold the safety with the big tight end, maybe DiPietro or one of those other guys inside. So you have a, a number of different things you can do. You can also run combination routes. So if you want to run the slant here, you can run the slide here. You can even run the quick wheel up the sideline, see which one of these guys takes them. So when you have the size outside, you can take advantage of those corners. Now, the other thing you have to do in the red zone is run the football. Well, we're going to try to find a running back this year to replace Ross Sherman. So look for Deshaun Brown, maybe some inside zone play. The big question mark this year is going to be that Lafayette offensive line. Can they hold up? Well, those quick hitters, double team up. Wheel out, try to get a quick seam inside. So you have those running plays, whether you're going to run sweep outside or keep it inside. But look for Mickey Fine to keep the running game in the red zone in between the tackles. Quick hitters, easy blocking for the offensive lineman, and then coming off that fake, trying to get somebody open on a quick route. Remember, slants, fades, up the sideline. Take advantage this week of the small corners with guys like Morozik, and Vangelis and Palumbo. Those are the guys to look for. Lafayette's got to score in the red zone. Going to be a big week. Kickoff, 6 o'clock.